What's going on YouTube? Official Keith here. And today we have a couple of watch faces from the main man, Matteo Dini. We're gonna feature the MD-112 and the MD-113. I feel like with the MD-112, the watch face itself is throwing a tribute to the watches that we used to wear back in the day. You know, you can even find watches that look like this today and people still wear them. This watch face is jam packed with features such as your step counts, your steps to gold, which is shown by a horizontal indicator. It even has a timeline, burn calories, battery icon status, and it also has eight app shortcuts. Those eight app shortcuts are the heart rate, calendar, set alarms, Samsung health, weather, message, music player, and your phone. Next up is the MD-113. And just by looking at this watch face for the first time, you can see that there's a lot of information going on in the watch face, but that's a good thing. Just like the MD-112, this watch face will also have a nice list of features, some of which include your step counts, it has three preset shortcuts, and it even has two customizable shortcuts, so you can make those shortcuts whatever you want them to be. You'll have a timeline, and you'll have your floor counter, and remember with the floor count, it only works on the Samsung Gear S3 and the Gear Sport. The three shortcuts that are preset on this watch face are the heart rate, Samsung health, and you can set alarms. As I mentioned earlier, you have the ability to customize two application shortcuts. Now if you look in between the 10 and the 11 position, the 3 and the 4 position, you'll see three small dots. You're going to want to double tap on those dots to see the custom applications that are available. And in order for this to work, your watch will need to be on Tizen version 2.3.2.3 or higher. Let's go ahead and get into some of the color change options on both of the watch faces. As always, thanks for taking some time to watch my videos. If you like this video, go ahead and smash that like button. And if you subscribe to the channel, make sure you click on the notification bell so you'll be notified when I upload my next video. Until next time, this is Official Keith. You're now official. We'll see you later.